I'm Darren at Desai, and this is a SolidWorks 2-Minute Tech Tip. When opening a file in SolidWorks, have you ever seen this message before? Well, it means the last time the file was saved, it was in an older version of SolidWorks. And if you hit Save Now, it's going to upgrade the file to the current version that you have the document open with. Well, have you ever wondered what version those files actually were last saved in? By going in Windows Explorer, all you have to do is activate a column. Just right-click on the existing column, go down to More, and then scroll down near the bottom to SW Last Saved Version. By turning on this column, you'll get a list of exactly what version was last used to save your SOLIDWORKS files. If you'd rather not go through the process of adding a column, just simply right-click any SOLIDWORKS file in Windows Explorer, go to Properties, and then the Details tab. There you'll also see the last saved version SOLIDWORKS property. You can pull off something similar inside of your PDM vault. You just have to add a variable called SOLIDWORKS model version. The version will actually display as a version code, and as long as you accompany the version code chart next to it, you'll be able to see what version name applies to that code. There is an enhancement request in to make this a little bit more streamlined. If you enjoyed this content and want to be notified when we upload future videos and blogs, just follow me on Twitter at DGHockeyTown or at Desai Solutions. Until next time, I'm Darren at Desai, your SolidWorks guy.